Hey guys, Ash here from CurseForward.com and in this video, I'm going to be showing you how to flash the CM10.1, that Cyanogen Mod 10.1 uh, onto your Galaxy S4 i9505, that's the Qualcomm Snapdragon variant. For people using the Exynos Octa-Core, that's i9500, CM10.1 isn't available yet. Once it's available, I will uh, make a video, I will add uh, annotation onto this video, I will add it in the description as well, so uh, check that out. Alright guys, uh, let's get started here. The prerequisite here is that you need to be rooted and you need to have custom recovery installed. So uh, if you aren't rooted or if you don't have a custom recovery like Clockwork Mod or TWRP installed, you can go ahead uh, follow my tutorial on how to do it uh, again the link is there in the description all right so what you do right now is click on the link number one in the download section in the description that will take you to a thread on xda developers forums so from there you need to download two files so there will okay you will find uh, links to two files so these will be the these are these will be the files uh one cm 10.1 zip and another g apps jb dot zip so once you download these files transfer it to your internal uh storage on your uh galaxy s4 so once you've done this go ahead hold the power button and hit power off so power down your device wait till the lights on the capacitor buttons turn off Alright, so now uh, hold the up volume, power and home buttons at the same time. Up volume, power and home. Let the keys go once you see Samsung Galaxy S4 displayed on screen. So now this will take you to your custom recovery. So I'm using TWRP recovery, but don't worry if, if you're using Clockwork Mod recovery. It's the same steps and I will walk you through it. Don't worry about it. Alright guys, now the first thing you do is hit install. And navigate to wherever it is that you've saved the CM files and first select this, uh, the bigger one that CM10.1 unofficial i9505.zip and swipe it to flash. Now if you're using clockwork mode recovery don't worry you will have an option called install zip from SD card and then choose zip from SD card. So just follow that option and select the file again and you can flash it. No issues. So there you see it's done. So guys at this point if you got an error or if you got stuck just pull your battery out and repeat the step. Alright so now go back and select the next one and hit uh, swipe to confirm flash. And now going back, back, select wipe, advanced wipe, select Dalvi cache, cache and data. So guys keep in mind uh, again with clockwork mod you will have wipe data factory reset and wipe cache on the first page and on the next page you will have uh, under advanced uh, on the first page you will find wipe dalvik cache so make sure you wipe all three now swipe to swapping to wipe done so going back and now hit reboot reboot system so let's just wait for this phone to boot up. All right, guys, we're up. So let me quickly run through setup. So that we have it CM 10.1. Just to confirm, going into settings, about phone, and there you see it, Android 4.2.2, and that's CM, uh, the unofficial version of uh, Cyanogen Mod 10.1, there you see Cyanogen Mod version, Android 4.2.2, Jelly Bean. So that's pretty much it for this video tutorial guys uh if you run into any issues or if you have any technical queries you can hit us up at cusperver.com forums and uh before you go don't forget to give me a thumbs up and hit the subscribe button because i'll be coming out with videos for the galaxy s4 and many more devices so that's pretty much it for now uh, once again thanks a lot for watching hope you guys like the video and i'll see you guys soon with my next video till then it's ashio from cusperver.com signing off you guys have a great day bye bye now